Hi guys and girls, Rose Burnett here from Mind Body Soul Balance. I'm sitting out here next to the ocean. You can probably hear it in the background here. I'm out on one of my uh, daily walks along the coast or wherever I choose to go in terms of connecting with nature and spirit. And I wanted to talk to you today about how do you uh, how do you maintain a positive mindset? And uh, often day to day life can be quite challenging, or we get stuck in uh, we get stuck in the past thoughts and thought patterns and things like that. And if you don't know, I have quite a if you're on my YouTube channel, hi. <laughs> I have quite a quite a growing YouTube channel, and uh, I guess I often walk along and think about what can I share with you and. Uh, you know, occasionally you get the negative person that shows up on the YouTube channel with their uh, their comments, and it's just that 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 stark contrast in terms of state of mind from being negative to positive, and how do you get yourself out of that? And I'm going to say to you, it's an individual choice. So if you don't know much about me, I'm a certified transformational coach as well as an NLP practitioner, advanced Reiki practitioner, about 20 years of uh, business background as well yeah so lots of experience to share with you and uh, one of the things that I found most helpful in terms of my own day-to-day -day living is how to maintain that positive mindset and to know when you're not when you're not in one you know and it's about listening to your moods as well as uh, you can be impacted by the environment around you but it's how you choose consciously choose each day to uh, control and manage your emotions and uh, you know you're not a victim in this world and uh, whilst there are things that can happen to us we as individuals have the responsibility to choose how we respond or react to that and uh, there's a big difference between reacting and responding yeah but it's also about well how do you how do you manage your emotions on a daily basis when things are getting you down and uh, how do you show up to change that and one of the big things is that you surround yourself with positive people and positive experiences and uh, you know I'm a great advocate for uh, I don't listen to the news ever I don't watch I don't watch normal TV um, because I don't want to absorb the negativity of it and there's so much out there you know if something's gonna if something major is gonna go off I'm gonna hear about it on social media yeah one way or the other it's gonna come through and yes I do have uh, you know I do have empathy for that for those situations but I choose to consciously make sure that my environment is as positive as it can be and uh, you know one of the reasons I'm out here today is that uh, just like everybody else we all have our own challenges that we deal with um, on a day-to-day -day basis and this is my way of releasing those stresses and balancing and grounding myself and uh, I guess uh, as a transformational coach I'm not somebody that goes when somebody comes up that's in, you know in a very negative state of mind Mind. Um, I'm not going to empathize with it no um, I'm gonna go pull yourself up because uh, you know I'm not here to I'm not here to I guess basically baby people either and uh, if you don't like that well it's just too bad do you know what I mean um, I have quite an adverse reaction to people that are stuck in the victim mode because you consciously choose each day how to how to manage your thoughts and your emotions and it's about realizing that and taking responsibility for that and you can't blame the people around you yes there can be circumstances that are outside of your control but you in every day every moment each moment have responsibility for how you show up in this world and uh, you can choose to be negative or you can choose to be positive um, and yeah sure there are some things that can be deeply challenging but it's about learning the strategies on how to cope with those and how to come back to a state of inner peace and balance and uh, it's not something that just happens you've got to actually work at it and you've got to work at it each day um, it's also a conscious life choice to have a very positive mindset and a very positive outlook on life and to try and make the best of it no matter what's happening yeah and uh, you know it's not about accepting the behaviors of others and, and you know people can impact us quite deeply because we're human right we're human we all want to connect we all want to be accepted we all want to fit in mostly some of us don't fit in yeah sometimes that's a that's an acceptance in itself because uh, we're a little different yeah and that's cool too um, but yeah, so it's, I guess it's my message to you is to uh, have a think about that. So if you're somebody that's out there that's struggling with your, with your uh, maintaining a level of positivity on a day-to-day -day basis, it's time to start uh, doing some work on that. Um, you can't expect other people around you to pick you up and prop you up. It comes from within. It's, it's, the, it's the inner work that you have to do in yourself. Yeah, um, and it starts with you. All right, so hey, I hope this helped. Get out there.
change your mindset because you can do it in an instant. Um, if somebody tells you, like, I'm sorry, even the people that are depressed, I'm going to say this. I mean, obviously, there's there's chemical reasons as well for why people get depressed. Um, and it's probably a touchy subject, right? But you can change your mindset in an instant by doing things like self-love, self-care, taking care of your nutrition, your, your health, your exercise, getting in great shape, enjoying what's around us, yeah? Let me swing you around so you can see where I'm sitting, yeah? Enjoying what is around you in nature and just finding those moments, those moments where you can just let go of all your struggle, all your worries, and take some time for self. And just appreciate, appreciate the goodness in life because there are good things in life, yeah? Alright. Love you heaps. Have a great day, peeps. Bye.